All right, so a number of you have asked, how do we use two LoRa's together inside of Flux? So I uh, access my Flux through FAL.ai, and uh, I've trained two models here. You can see I've got one I trained three months ago and one I trained five days ago. Five days ago is actually a style training, so I can actually apply it. But what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to, first of all, go ahead and click Run Inference on the one that you want to add. So I'm going to click that here a minute, and it's going to give me a code here in just a second. Let's try that again. There we go. And then we're going to copy the path right here for that LoRa. Really important. We need to remember that. I'm going to go back to my last page. I'm going to go ahead and run inference to actually use the primary one that I want. And you can see this is loaded up with my trigger word and everything else. I'm going to go down here to add item. Move my picture out of the way. And we're going to just paste in that path. So now we're using both LoRa's, step one and step two. In order to call that in, I need to use my also my trigger word for my second Laura in this case which happens to be 3d cartoon because it's a 3d cartoon style so I could say uh, Jonathan just masked as a 3d cartoon um, let's just say New Year's um, I don't know what to say here it's, <laughs> uh, it's 3d cartoon uh, as a 3d cartoon entrepreneur with a long white beard. We'll just make it simple like that. All right, so I can go ahead and pick all the rest of my settings here, my default, how many images I want, all that various stuff. Notice when you do this, though, you do have some scale, so you can determine how you want to do this. So this should, I'm going to bump this up to 1.5. If you want to play around with the numbers, that's going to help me determine exactly uh, how much weight I want to give to that secondary LoRa. And we're going to go ahead and click Run. So we'll go ahead and click run here a minute. It'll come over. Let's see what we get. And waiting not so patiently, of course. And we'll see what images we get here. And then here we come. So we're going to end up with four images. And there you can see so it's applied my comic style and my Laura together to create these images. Hope that's helpful, guys.